one of the biggest, uh, one of the biggest criticisms I get in my act is, how come everything has to be political with you? How come everything has to have a political point? I can't help it. I'm a killjoy who does comedy. Like this, this is how I'm hardwired, right? I'm this annoying in real life, right? Like my parents are getting older, right? When you have older parents, you have to have difficult conversations with them. What they want for their final wishes, right? Cremation, funeral. These are difficult conversations that I've been having recently. And because I am who I am, I decided it was time to tell my parents what I wanted for my final wishes, right? <laughs> so I told them, I said, if I'm ever murdered, it's very important that the killer doesn't get the death penalty because I don't believe in state violence. So don't push for the death penalty. I don't want my death to lead to another death, regardless of what this person did to me or to my body, I don't want the killer to get the death penalty. And I remember what my mother said to me. She said, why do you always have to ruin dinner? <laughs> it's not about dinner, mom. It's about my final wishes and they should be respected. You're not that famous, hurry. Nobody's gonna kill you, okay? You don't know that dad tells people I'm Aziz Ansari. You don't even know. I could be killed by accident. <laughs> Sometimes people ask me, how come when you do impressions of your parents, you don't use accents? And the answer to that question is fuck you. That's why, that's why I don't use accents. My parents are immigrants with accents. I'm sure they have it hard enough. People questioning their intelligence, making fun of them behind their back. I don't wanna, I don't wanna make their life any harder, even though like they laugh at Chinese accents, so they kind of deserve it, but like. <laughs> But I'm not gonna do that to them. I love my parents. I don't wanna put them through anything else, right? Like I think about what my mom's been through in this country, right? People saying things like, take that dot off your head, or why are you wearing bed sheets out of the house? Or why don't you shut up and make me food? And this is just stuff me and my brother said to her growing up. Now can you imagine what she dealt with out of the house? People who didn't love her. For those of you who are groaning right now, my mom approved that joke, so go to hell, all right? My mom specifically told me to tell that joke. She, she told me to. She said, yes, tell them you're a piece of shit. Tell them that, tell them. Tell them how disappointed you and your brother are. Please tell them that. Tell them about the terrible hand I've been dealt. Please let them know. My mom is the funniest person I know. My mom is the reason I'm funny. My dad's the reason I have anxiety, but my mom, my mom is the reason I'm funny. And like a lot of us, I've taken my mom for granted. So recently I decided to make a list of all the funny things my mom has been saying. So here are a few of my favorite mom jokes, right? <laughs> Actual things that my mom has said. First thing, I called my mom and I said, hey mom, sorry I didn't call earlier this week. And she said, it's okay, it was a relief. 